So how much does um, like taste of food affect your ability to just eat a million of them? It's, uh, it's huge. People think that yeah, I'm not tasting food at all. But it's like a race car driver. If a race car driver is on a bad road, just because they're driving fast doesn't mean they can't feel it. It's, it's all, everything's kind of magnified. So if there's a flavor in there I'm not liking, it's going to hit me again and again and again. So, and again and again and again. And yeah, and again so, and again. so it's going to, so I, I if this, I'm really lucky. I've tried their brisket and uh, it, it's, it's going to be some good sandwiches. We're probably going to see a new world record. And I, uh, I'm, I, I feel like it, it, it's going to be an amazing crowd. They're looking like 70,000 people in the audience. And uh, I'm, I'm amped. I'm so excited. How do you, how do you prepare? Uh, do you eat anything today? No, almost no, no, no solid food today. I had a salad yesterday and it's a liquid diet today. So I'm going to go in nice and empty and loose. I drink lots of liquid so that it's a, it's, so I'm loose. And then also it's, it's a easy to digest that massive amount of food. Oh my gosh. And, and when you're building up to it, how do you, are you allowed to tell me how you prepare? I, I mean, I prepare, I, I did a little practice on Sunday. I cooked up some brisket and I, I and I, I love it. So it's, uh, I, I'm a little bit worried about practicing with brisket. That's not going to be the con same as the contest. Mm -hmm. So uh, I didn't want to do too much practice, but I, I feel like I have a good technique and I'm just going to find a, find a rhythm do this take the same size bite, take a little sip of water and swallow, make sure I keep breathing the same way as a runner. They don't sprint in the, in the beginning necessarily like a marathon runner. I just control my breathing, find, do the same thing, get all the muscles in my body to work together to jiggle the food down. The consistency. Yeah, Does it consistency. help when you jiggle? Oh yeah, I'm, really, I'm just trying to get that food to settle deep inside of me. Oh my gosh, this is so amazing. Um, when did you realize you were really good at eating food? Oh my god, I, I, I grew up in a family of six kids, so everybody knew in the family knew I was the biggest eater in the family, and I, uh, and it just got more as a more obvious as I was in college. During while well, I was in college, I'd eat healthy during the week. On the weekends, I'd go home to my parents' house and just eat everything, and. Uh, then my little brother signed me after my first contest when I was 21, and it just kind of snowballed. I was like, oh my god, I'm, I'm, they're paying me to eat, and I get to travel around the world and, and beat people. And it just kept getting bigger, and now, I'm, now, now I have the best job in the world. And you still enjoy eating? Oh, I, I love it. It's, I mean, God, it, it's, it's the best thing. It, it's, it's, uh, I, I, it, I, yeah, I love it too much, maybe. <laughs> nah, you probably the right amount. Yeah. Um, have you gotten to try any other Austin food? And will you get, after you eat on Saturday, are you like, okay, I don't want to eat anymore after this? this like, is, what's your feeling after so the this one's a, this is a 10 minute contest and it's brisket and it's kind of, it, it's, it's, a, it's gonna be a fast contest. So I'm not gonna be, I'm probably not gonna be eating much on a Saturday night, but Sunday I should be able to eat. And then I'm, I'm, I'm staying for the race on Sunday and I'm staying on Tuesday. And uh, I'll, I'll definitely get, try to get, I'm gonna try to get to, to where is my favorite barbecue? Uh, Terry Black's, Franklin's, La Barbecue, well, Franklin, Salt Lake. Frank, yeah, Franklin's uh -huh. is closed on Monday, but Salt Lake is open on okay. Monday. So I'll, I'll be bringing some beer to Salt Lake and uh, have some have some brisket there. Oh my gosh, this is the most insane thing to me. What's the like best food that you've ever oh, had? That I've ever had? It's weird because I, I love to eat and I get cravings. And it, the best okay. thing is when I, when I can fulfill that craving that I'm like, like when I'm craving a good, good Mexican food, good, good tacos, uh, seafood. If I'm craving a king crab and I'm able to get that crave and able to fill that craving, it's like the best. Um, yeah, I, I love I love a good hot dog at a baseball game. A hot dog and a beer. You can still eat hot dogs. Oh my god, I love them. It's uh, how fast do you eat them when you're eating them at a baseball game? I'm not gonna. I'm not eating them super fast, but I'm probably <laughs> gonna eat them faster than you. <laughs> okay, I, I don't know. I love them. I know it's it's, it's the best. Uh, what is your typical portion size when you're eating food? Are you just you just like regularly no, eat, and then you're just all of a sudden these competitions come up, and you're like, now I can eat. Yeah, so it's it's kind of a battle. I because I, I, I love to eat so much, I'm always trying to count my calories. I'm trying to because if I get carried away, I can just, I'll eat way too much, then I start gaining weight, and then I start losing contests. So I, I'm always trying to I'm always monitoring it, making sure that uh, I'm not eating too much. So. But it, it, it's kind of like I go back into the, how I started. I, I eat healthy during the week, and on the weekends I get to reward myself in the contest mode. And it's, and I, I love it when it's a food like brisket or, or, or shrimp or something that I really love. It's like the, it's like the biggest reward day ever. Okay. Now I have something that I'm gonna get, and then I'm gonna ask you a couple more questions. So it won't take more than two seconds. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm back. 
<laughs> what do you think? I think it's awesome. Thank you so much. Have you ever been interviewed by a hot dog before? I, uh, you have. I, I, I don't think I have. No, no. I, okay. I, was, I was gonna say I've been hot dog for a, for Halloween many times. Have you? Oh yeah, yeah. It's, I was it's, on for Halloween yesterday. At work. It's great. Okay, so while I'm dressed in my hot dog costume, um, will you tell me about the competition for July Fourth? Because you're the champion. Oh yeah. How many hot dogs did you eat? My record's 74 in 10 minutes, and it's just the biggest contest of the year. It's my Super Bowl and and World Series all combined in one. Everybody there has a either their previous champion or they've won a contest to be able to compete there. So it's it, it's the it, nobody has any excuses on that day. You you bring it, and uh, I usually bring it a little bit more than everybody else. I'm so excited for you, and I hope you win this brisket competition because it's brand new. It's a brand new contest. It's going to be uh, in front of, I think, probably one of the biggest audiences of any competitive eating contest ever. Do you get ever. nervous? I, I get so nervous. I get nervous for interviews. I get nervous <laughs> every time I get on stage, but I think it's good. I think it's good to, I, I, my first minute of the contest isn't my fastest just because I'm so nervous. Uh -huh. I have to find, find a rhythm, and I, once I find that rhythm, I can uh, usually just run away with it. Oh, thank you so you much. Eat so many brisket sandwiches. For, for brisket sandwiches, there's no uh, no dunking. So I'm, you can't dunk. There's no dunking in this because uh, they don't want it to fall apart, and then people are getting well, away yeah, with. Yeah, brisket does fall apart. So, uh, so you're doing. So I'm I'm gonna have to drink the water. So it's gonna be a little bit slower. It's gonna be a little bit more a little bit more coordination than hot dogs maybe. So it's uh, we'll see. I, I feel good about it though. I've, I've tasted it, and it's it's. Do it's, you know who you're going up against? I, I yeah, we all know each other. It's a weird. A weird underground world, all the eaters, and uh, we, we talk trash, and uh, we we're, we're kind of we're friends, but we're enemies, so we're frenemies. And uh, day of the contest, we're we're just, we're serious. Oh, I love it. Yeah. Do you ever talk trash while you're eating? Uh, Do you ever count out never, loud? Never, never, like when you're ahead, are you ever like no, 70? No, seventy-one. So, so sometimes I'll stand up straight and I'll smile, and they they know that I know I'm ahead when, when I'm like when, I, when I'm standing up straight, and it's like. And are you counting in your head as I, you're doing it? I'm trying not to count too much, but I'm just trying to focus on doing the same things over. But I, I, I you, you count plates a little bit because every plate has the same number uh, of okay. food, so you, I can tell when when I move on to the next plate faster than the next guy. So I, I know I'm on my head, and but you lose count of plates eventually also. So it's um, you, it's it's hard to count. So it's, you can just tell by you have a feeling. I like I know when I, I know what 74 hot dogs feels like, so I know what it, what it, when I'm when I'm there. And you go in hungry. Like I go you're in, hungry. Oh, I go in hungry. It's uh, I'm empty and loose. Uh, it's close to 40 hours. No, no eating at all. No solid food, and it's just, it's just who? It's 10 minutes of playtime. Whoever wants the worst.